Good Monday morning. Thanks for joining us here on Good Morning Idaho. If you received an email claiming to be from Better Business Bureau saying there's a complaint against you for violating a federal act, don't click anything. BBB's Emily Villa joins us this morning. Good morning, Emily. Good morning. Tell us about this new phishing scam. So scammers are impersonating BBB using our name and logo to send emails to business owners and managers saying there's a complaint because they violated the Fair Labor Standards Act or the Health and Safety Act. Kind of ominous making business owners want to act now, but don't do it. These these scammers are trying to get these business owners to click a link or download an attachment to read the full copy of the complaint. But in reality, of course, that's downloading malware to a device. Not good at all. Now, if you get one of these emails, what should you exactly be looking for? First thing, check that return address. If BBB is reaching out to you, it'll be a BBB.org email address. If it's not, big red flag. Watch for generic emails with no information about you, not your name or your business name, and any sort of uh, those red flags like misspellings, grammatical errors, red flags, and hover over any links, see where they actually go to. And what happens if you got one of these emails and you actually did click on the link? What should you do now? It does happen. One business owner called us and said that he thought it was real, tried to download that attachment, and nothing came through. So in reality, he was likely just downloading a virus to his computer. Not a good situation. You do want to take it seriously and act right away. If you're not sure what to do, turn that computer completely off, contact a reputable IT company in town, reach out to them, or contact your business's IT company if you do have that available to you. As a general rule, keep those systems up to date, download those system updates, and also make sure you're running your antivirus software regularly. All right, thanks, Emily. Definitely something to keep an eye out for. And remember, Better Business Bureau has a number of resources to help you protect your identity and your money. You can always find more at BBB.org. Thanks, Emily. Thank you.